Okay, so here I am at the end. And what I have done is this. I've just double wrapped this. I'm holding this just for a second. If you look in here, you will see that these two are just barely butted up against each other. All right. And you can't see it, but um, the uh, rim filler is just butted up against each other as well. So you'll see this here as we get going. Now it's going to get tight. Okay. And you can see that my middle stake is um, pretty short. But we'll carry on. So here's where it gets tough. You still got to go underneath that. And I have put that down, so I'm going to thread it through. You can open it up just a little bit. And I still want this flat, and there's just a lot of garbage in the way here, so. So this last little bit is your um, it's probably the hardest part of the whole lashing just because you're so limited on space here especially because you're still trying to go in between that uh, outer rim and the inside wall of the basket so if when I get right there I'm going to do another double wrap but I think I can get away with one more time here. So now I can do a double wrap. This should be the last of my double wraps. I'm going to hold it with a clip that one last time just so I get it good and tight. Go around that twice. Okay, lift that off, and once again, ooh, it's windy out today, since last we met, I'm going to keep going, oop, I should have went underneath that rim, but to be honest with you, that is so dang tight right now, I don't think I'm going to bother with it, I'd have to claw that up and underneath, and we're right at the tail end, so it's not mandatory. And that is as far as that's going to let me go because of this guy. If not, I would have went uh, a little bit further, but I, I've lost my last stake. I could back up and put another piece in here, but I'm not going to bother doing that. So what I'm going to do is I might be able to pick up I don't think I can do that either. I was going to uh, see if I could pick up. Maybe I can get one more in here. That bottom one's from uh, the start of it. But I don't think I can do that. So what I'm going to do at this point is I'm going to trim these off. And like I said, if that would have been longer, I would have kept braiding it till over here. But I don't think I have that option. I don't know if I can get a piece underneath there or not. Let's see. I can do that. Now, hopefully yours is long enough so you don't have to jerry-rig this. I might be able to get that underneath there. We'll see. 
maybe. But my uh, my guy's down there anyway, so it doesn't matter. I don't need to do that. So I'm going to wrap around a couple more times here over the whole thing just to seal the deal. three times and then what I'm gonna do actually I think I'll go four so I got some extra here and then I'm gonna cut these back so I'm gonna take my all <coughs> give it your all and I'm gonna open up underneath there underneath all with the all and then I'm gonna take this piece and thread it through there always works better if you got a point and pull that tight oh good I just popped where I wanted it to got lucky that time these I'm going to take off. Now, I would have liked to have gone farther with that, but it just was not in the cards. So, it wouldn't hurt to put a little piece of glue on that to make sure it's not going to come out. And these are all my starts. I'm going to trim them off. So, we got one more here. So, you all got their basket done today. There you go. You guys did a great job. Thanks so much for joining me today.